Welcome to our next episode. This one's about epidemiological transition. This model has four, sometimes considered five stages, and we're going to go ahead and take a look at each one of them. Stage one is pestilence and famine. This is where infectious diseases and animal attacks and parasites killed off humans. Thomas Malthus looked at this as basically a natural check, and it matches into stage one of the demographic transition model, where we have high births and high deaths. In stage two, we start seeing the receding pandemic situation. This is where sanitation and nutrition and medicine start taking hold, and we stop seeing people die of things that killed them in stage one. Perfect example, Dr. John Snow. He is examining cholera in London, and what he noticed was that all the, the cases of it were happening in one area of the Soho region. Well, when he overlapped that map with a lap map of wells, he discovered that one well seemed to be the problem. And when they took a look at the water in there, they found out that it was contaminated with sewage. So the sewage that was in that neighborhood was mixing in with the well, and obviously it was kind of a um, crappy situation for the residents of that area. And cholera comes from polluted water. So once they learned to cap that well, they saw cholera go away. So this is stage two in what we start learning to do to be able to modify our environment to survive. Stage 3 and Stage 4 are related in this model. Stage 3 is the degenerative disease stage. This is where we start talking about heart attacks and cancer causing human deaths. We're not worried about infectious diseases much anymore. Stage 4 is also degenerative disease, but we talk about delayed degenerative disease. So we're still talking about things that were killing us from Stage 3, but we're now also talking about old age. We're talking about Alzheimer's, more about obesity things that affect us because we're not eating well and that we're just living longer. The final stage is stage five. This is kind of like stage five of the demographic transition model where it's kind of like unofficial. This is the resurgence of things that we thought were wiped out. So diseases that we vaccinated for before are coming back. A perfect example is how a lot of people aren't vaccinating children right now. Diseases that had been annihilated and wiped out are now coming back because of the lack of vaccination. So that's what we're trying to describe here in the stage five. 